stupid side down here. Hola, and welcome to the first ever Latino movie show. My name is Juan, and... John. Your name is John. Usted want to be Latino. My name is Juan, and this is Ramiro. My name is Romero, but the ladies call me Romeo. Really? And what ladies would those be? I don't remember you having a single date in the three months that I've lived here with you. Do you think I'd bring someone back to this dump? There have been plenty of ladies. Sure there have. Now that the Football World Cup is over, we thought we'd try and fill the viewing void with the Latino Movie Show, where I will be reviewing movies with a Latino background. And I'll be reviewing new popular releases. By popular, you mean American films. Well, John, 90% of films shown in Australia originate from the U.S., so yes, I'll be reviewing popular American films. Crappy, formulaic... American Crappy, films. formulaic American films with huge explosions, great car chases, and cheap and easy women. What? Hey, take it or leave it. I'm only doing this stupid show to help you out anyways. He's got a crush on one of the presenters on Latina Fusion. I do not have a crush on Catalina. Oh, I know you don't. It's the dude who looks like the Colombian rope you have a crush on, homo. Whatever. Until this show gets some sponsors, uh, we will only be reviewing films that we can get for free. I'll be downloading new releases from BitTorrent on the internet. Films are often released in cinemas outside of Australia weeks and sometimes even months before they finally make it to our screens. These films are often readily available for downloading from the internet within days of their US release. Bravo, Capitan Avio. My neighbors have wireless broadband, which I will be borrowing from them. I will be borrowing Latino films from friends and family of friends to review. Sound good? Sounds pretty lame to me. At this stage, we're not sure if we'll be able to show clips from the movies we review. We'll get the Channel 31 legal department to look into that for us. They have a legal department? Yeah, I think. Until then, we can act out scenes from the movies that we review. I don't think so. No. It'll only be for a week or so. Uh, no. The first film that we'll be reviewing is Pirates of the Caribbean, Dead Man's Chest. Ramiro! Uh, no, actually, it hasn't finished downloading yet. What? Oh, didn't I tell you? It's been stuck on 86% for a while now. Too many leeches, not enough cedars. But it should be ready in about a week or so. Great. What else have you got for us? Um, well, I guess I could review Superman Returns. I did see it last week. Okay, good. Ramiro will now review Superman Returns. Ramiro! Um, I don't actually have anything prepared, but, um... Look, I guess it was a pretty good film. The sound was good. And the picture was alright. It was a bit dark. There was also two or three coughing fits close to the guy holding the camcorder. But, look, it was during the boring bits, so I guess, I guess that's alright. What about the acting? The character arcs? The story? Oh, okay, well, look, Superman's away for a number of years, and when he comes back, he finds out that Lois Lane has a kid. In the meantime, Lex Luthor escapes from jail, and he has this crystal which he stole from Superman's Fortress of Solitude, and he's planning on creating this whole new world. It's whoa, great later. whoa, don't give it all away. Uh, some of our viewers may not have seen it yet. Oh, make up your mind. So, what score would you give it? Look, I don't know. I guess five. Wow. Really? Five out of five for Superman Returns? Out of five? Out of five. Who writes things out of five? Margaret and David? Fine. Two and a half. No, wait. Three out of five. Okay. So, Superman Returns, three out of five. What about you? What are you going to be reviewing? Oh, well, I was going to review Bolero, the film that you got for me, but I think someone swapped to the video. It turned out to be a soft porn film. Did it make you uncomfortable seeing a naked woman? So I've decided to review Evita, a musical based on Evita Duarte Perón. So you're reviewing a musical. Pretty gay even for you. Evita stars Madonna and Antonio Banderas and is based on the Andrew Lloyd Webber play. Looks like we're getting the wind-up. What? No, I haven't given it a score yet. We gotta go. Um, I give Evita um, four and a half out of five. Um, gotta, a great film. We gotta go in ten. Um, Nine. Uh, next week I'll be reviewing Como Agua para Chocolate and Ramiro will be talking about Pirates of the Caribbean Dead Man's Chest. Bye.
Hasta luego.